so in this video we'll look at spring boot maven plugin so this is basically the official documentation for spring boot maven plugin so this particular plugin provides spring boot support uh, in apache maven it and it allows you to package executable jar or var archives run your spring boot application generate build information and start your spring boot application prior to running integrations tests basically so this plugin is basically provided by spring boot to support these various features and we can include this uh, particular plugin in our parent pom and it can be used in our uh, uh, child projects as well so this is this plugin basically it can be used with spring boot starter parent project as well but we don't have this spring boot starter parent project we have our own parent project so in order to use it with our uh, uh, with without spring boot parent pom we have to configure it uh, it in this way so basically it supports these many goals uh, in order to run your spring boot application you can start your spring boot application and stop it you can run the test in your spring boot application also you can do repackage so basically repackaging existing jar or var archives so that they can be executed from command line using java hyphen jar command so using java hyphen jar command and providing the jar name you can run your application from the command line so this repackage goal is uh, for that same purpose so we want to add this repackage goal in an, uh, in this plugin itself so in order to add that we want to add this plugin into our uh, uh, parent pom so this is basically our parent pom and within this build tag we want to add uh, plugin management we we don't want this plugin to be included in all the projects because we because all of our projects are not runnable projects basically if you look at the client project it's not uh, it doesn't have to run basically because it is just a, a library which is used across all our microservices for uh, basically uh, including the faint client related uh, common classes so we would add this plugin into uh, into our plugin management tag and this plugin this plugin management tag uh, allows us to include this plugin only in the required sub modules basically so we have added this plugin and now we will just refresh this so this has been uh, downloaded and we only want this plugin to be included in child projects which needs to be uh, run as a spring boot application so we'll just add it in so we'll just add build tag here in our child project which is api gateway and inside this we'll add this plugin Plugin and basically we'll just copy the same artifact from here so I have just forgot to include version so we'll add the version which is 3.0.5 which is the latest version as I speak and we'll just include it here so now you can see our child POM is referring to parent POMs Spring Boot Maven plugin as you can see this arrow which is pointing to the root project basically so it is just referring there so we can include this plugin only in the projects which we want to run so we don't want this client to be uh, a running Spring Boot application so we don't add it there we'll just add it in our customer project then Eureka server then fraud detection service and notification service so we want all 
this services to be uh, running Spring Boot application. So I have added this plugin into uh, the required sub modules only. So this, as far as configuration is uh, concerned for this Spring Boot Maven plugin, the configuration part is done. And now we are ready to uh, run the other build phases of Maven build cycle. So see you in next lecture. Thank you.